Oh well, I'm out here in the middle of nowhere with my bike and I'm looking for a place to sleep but yeah there's this cabin over here Cabinas Liz but uh yeah I tried contacting them and uh, they're not responding on WhatsApp and since I don't speak Spanish I won't be able to call them so yeah guess I'll have to go somewhere else well this certainly wasn't the smartest idea I've ever had because now the plastic bag I had it broke and I can't fit it in my bag so I have no way to carry this stuff with me so yeah what am I gonna do okay so somehow I've managed to fit it all in there you can see my shoes are sticking out on the sides my vape is sticking out and yeah the water I'll have to carry so wish me luck and we're back to the beach a different one this time let's check it out I've made it to another town, which uh, was about 35 kilometers to ride, and it's another $20 place I'm staying in, $20 a night, and well, I've got a whole rooftop bar to myself here. about 100 meters from the ocean which you can see there She does love the attention. Good morning. So far it's been uh, quite the adventure, you know. Riding my bike yesterday. 35 kilometers. It's not that far, but for me, I'm not really in shape, so... It, uh, it was pretty uh, intense for me especially since I can't stand the heat so yeah I think uh, I took a nice day off today just chilling and yeah tomorrow I think I'm gonna leave really early in the morning like as early as I can possibly go just so I can uh, avoid the heat you know I'm gonna try to leave at maybe five or six and then yeah should be able to get to the next town before uh, 
it gets really, really hot. So today it would just be another day of chilling, looking at the sunset tonight, having a couple beers maybe. And then yeah, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning or tonight at the sunset. So yeah, until then. Okay, yeah, I don't know what I was thinking. This road, it's literally nothing but rocks and dirt and potholes and hills. And I'm absolutely destroyed. Just look how steep this fucking hill is. You can't even see it because it goes down so far. And it's like a couple of hundred meters. Oh, man, this road. Like here it's actually okay. But all the roads I've been on, it's been like roads where literally the entire road is just one big pothole. Oh, man. I haven't really recorded any of it because yeah I'm holding my my bottle and with the other hand I'm holding the brake when I'm going downhill. Oh man. Maybe if you're like a top athlete, you know, then this is okay, but for me, oh my god, what did I get myself into? Yeah, you probably can't see it on camera, but my shirt, it's literally like I jumped in a pool. And that's how wet it is from the sweat. Oh, man. Maybe I should uh, quit smoking soon. That might help. <laughs> so... Check out this little house I'm staying in now. It's uh, $25 a night. And as you can see, I have my own private property here. Yeah, well, I'll show you guys inside. Yeah, we have our own kitchen. Nice big fridge. A private bathroom. With a noodle head shower. As Harold Boulder would uh, always check. And then outside probably have to use the key to unlock it. But yeah, as you can see, outside, we even have our own little private pool. Isn't that awesome? It's $25 a night in Costa Rica. Now, if you ask me, this is a good deal. Man, it even has YouTube and Netflix and everything.
Well, I'm gonna enjoy myself here for a while. A little beer.